If you're looking to buy cheap and custom controllers, be sure to check out singegaming.com and use discount code CSHD for 5% off. What's going on guys, Casual Savage here, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to make transparent text on Sony Vegas Pro 11, 12 and 13. Now, I know my desktop is messy, it's because I've been preparing stuff for my gaming channel. But yeah, anyway, let's get into it. First of all, I'm just going to go ahead and drag a background on for where I want the text to be transparent on. So there we go, and then we just right click here, and click insert video track. Now, you want this video track to be above the background track, like that. And then, you're going to be able to find this here and go to media generators. If this is not here, what you want to do, go to view. Windows layout and click default layout and you can see it comes out all default here and it should be here now once you are here pick which one you want obviously you want one with a transparent background so that means one with this in the background so you can see here the checkered background that means it will just show the text with no background so I like the soft shadow text so we're going to pick that one just drag it in there just type in what you want to say. So I wanted to say that. It's done. Okay. So now we want that to fade out. So what you do, go to the top of it. And boom. There you go. You can see it changes the transparency. That is on zero. But there you go. You can see it does change. And yeah, that is basically it. That is how you do it. Now if you're using it in a video, you can see it will stay transparent throughout, like that. And it is really simple to do. Now another way you can do this, let's just say you don't have this at the top. Well, it's another simple way. You just go here and drag the slider level down. Now you can see that does also change the opacity of the text. And that's basically it. Now let's just say for some reason you want to have the background, like that. You can see it changes that opacity as well. Then maybe you could have this a bit down as well. And you can see it gives it a dark effect, which it could look good. So you can just go ahead and play around with that as well. And yes, yeah, so then what you have to do, just choose where you want it to show. So probably there. And then you're basically done. Now, of course, you can make thumbnails in this. So what you can do then is just click snapshot here. Choose where you want to save it. And there you go, you've just created the image like that. Now this works with any text, so any text or font you have, it will work with. So I'm just going to go ahead and change it, just show you real quick that it does work with any text. So I'm just going to go random. And yeah, it will be different for each text. As you can see, it may not be as good, so you might want to put it down a bit. But yeah, you just find out how good you want it. But yeah, that is it, being casual savage here. It is really simple to do. Now, next video, I'm going to be showing you how to make a thumbnail on Sony Vegas Pro 12 or 13 or, of course, 11. And that video will be out tomorrow. Be sure to subscribe to my channel. And yeah, be sure to like my Facebook page. Follow me on Twitter, where I do post gaming news and technology news daily. Also, be sure to check out my gaming channel, where I upload daily as well. Also, I have Snapchat, where I just show you what I do throughout my day. Finally... This right here is actually a YouTube banner I created and I'm thinking of giving it away as a template so if you want it I'm going to upload it to YouTube for anyone to have. And yeah it's been Casual Savage here, I hope you like this video, please subscribe, rate and peace.